certainly rattled the markets early on because it was a question of why is oil going so high, especially with some of the news that we've gotten recently. Of course, the news over the re weekend has been that the Saudis are going to increase oil production, maybe by 200,000 uh, barrels, uh, 200,000 barrels, maybe half million. The, the, the actual, actual amount is very unclear right now. But just to put that in perspective, right now in the United States, every day we use more than 20 million barrels of oil. So just even a slight increase like that from the Saudis isn't going to move the needle much. In the meantime, we had the president talking with the prime minister of Britain, uh, Gordon Brown. Uh, Mr. Brown, the prime minister, was talking about uh, increasing sanctions in Iran. That also added some stress to the market because traders do not like to hear about any unrest in the Middle East at all. And then closer back to home, we have options expiring in the oil market, which means that there is a reason or motivation for traders to pull. Now, finally, maybe finally, Howard Stern and Ofer Winfrey can share the same company name. We'll just keep our fingers crossed to see if it actually is going to go through. But it looks more likely that it's going to happen. And let's talk a little bit that you want all the sports coverage. So that's something good for you as well. The other thing is that the companies, uh, uh, which would be Sirius, Sirius is actually buying out XM. So Sirius would have to agree to let their licensing for the technology go out to more companies, which would mean that they could make the satellite radios that would allow you to get the service. Right now, they have a real tight hold on that. So they control it. But it would this would allow, you know, you have some uh, more consumer choices of the different devices you use. So all these things look to be on the benefit of consumers as well as investors. You see both of the stocks rallying right now. Uh, so it does seem after this long wait that we might actually see uh, just one satellite radio channel moving forward, maybe into the summer. Jenna Lee. The idea for this car is we're going to look at it as a lease basis because there's only going to be about 200 out there. So uh, a three-year lease is going to